What's the best e-commerce platform for your online e-commerce store? You have multiple platforms to choose from to host your online store on. You have Wix, you have WooCommerce and WordPress, you have Squarespace. But the best platform, in my opinion, is Shopify. S-H-O-P-I-F-Y. Shopify is the tool to create and host your online store on. It's one of the simplest ones to use and familiarize yourself with. It's user-friendly, it's tech-friendly, it's perfect for non-techies like most of the people out there, maybe yourself and myself included. It doesn't require coding knowledge about HTML coding, JavaScript, so you don't really need to understand advancedly about these things. With Shopify, you can integrate apps easily from the Shopify App Store. They have selections of over thousands of apps to choose from. Most of them are free, but some of them do require a payment. But here's the thing with the ones that do actually require a payment. They either have one, a specified time duration for a free trial. So maybe they give you a 14-day or a 30-day trial to use their app on your store. If you like it, then you can continue with the paid subscription. If you don't, then just cancel it. Secondly, they have a free version of their app. So maybe they have a, a premium version, which comes with all of the features they have to pay for. And then they have another free version, which you can use, which has lesser features, but it's perfect for beginners to start familiarizing with, with themselves with the app, knowing how to use it, and if they like it, then they can continue and upgrade to the premium paid version. Just like how MailChimp structures their email marketing software, they give a free, free version of their software, and then when their customers reach 2,000 subscribers and above, then they start charging for a paid plan. Shopify integrates easily with the biggest and well-known external payment gateways out there, such as PayPal, Stripe, Braintree, MolPay, 2Checkout, and various other external payment gateways that are widely known around the world. They also have their own payment gateway, which is called Shopify Payments, to accept credit or debit card transactions through their Shopify stores. As of right now, in 2018, there are only nine countries that have Shopify payments available for the citizens in those countries to use. They are the United States, UK, Canada, Australia, Ireland, New Zealand, Puerto Rico, Hong Kong, and Singapore. So these nine countries, only the citizens in these nine countries or regions can actually use Shopify payments to accept credit or debit card transactions through their Shopify stores. Now, if you are one of the citizens in these countries, then you just enter in your details, your name, your social security number, your company name, and any other necessary details, and you're good to go. So if you're living in one of these nine countries, congratulations. You can use Shopify payments to accept credit or debit card transactions on top of also accepting PayPal transactions through your store. It's easier for you because for people like me in Malaysia, we cannot use Shopify payments. The advantage that you have is that you can accept credit and debit card transactions without integrating with a third-party external payment gateway like 2Checkout. Next, with Shopify, you can get a free 14-day Shopify trial. And even after the free trial has finished, after the 14 days, unless you enter in your credit card info, you choose a plan, a paid plan, you won't be charged. So you just use the 14-day trial. If you don't, don't like it, if you don't think that it suits your business well, then just cancel it and there won't be any harm, nothing wrong. Now I have a secret with the free 14-day Shopify trial. You want to hear it? This is actually something that no Shopify guru, e-commerce expert are actually talking about. Here's the secret. If you feel that the 14-day free trial given by Shopify is not enough, you need more time. Maybe you have other things to do. You need to focus on other matters in your life. 
just go to the email that you use to subscribe with the free trial in Shopify and you email support at shopify.com support at shopify.com and just ask for a, an extension of your free trial or you could go to the Shopify live chat at help.shopify.com forward slash questions you chat with a real life person over there and say and give give a reason why you need an, an extension and just ask for it, an extension on that free trial they will gladly give it to you because they want to have you as a customer for them especially if they know that you're serious about business because they're confident enough in their software in their tool that they can provide an extension on top of the free trial that they're already giving to their users shopify is the best right <laughs> moving on to the paid plans now the paid plans it starts from as low as 29 dollars per month that roughly converts to a conversion rate around 115 ringgit Malaysia. When you're first starting out, yes, just if you want to proceed with the paid plan, just select the basic plan for $29 per month. Further along, when you're more advanced, then you can move on to more advanced plans, more higher plans, such as the Shopify and the advanced Shopify plan. So basically, they have three plans. They have the basic plan, the Shopify plan, and also the advanced Shopify plan with fees of $29 per month, $79 per month, and $299 per month, respectively. There's also another version of the Shopify plan, which is called the Shopify Plus plan. Now, these are only for advanced, super, super advanced businesses with high amounts of sales volumes, high customer base, very established brand. Furthermore, in Shopify, it's easier to just buy a domain name directly with Shopify instead of going to third-party providers and integrating the domain name for the third-party domain providers into your Shopify hosting platform. Shopify acts as a domain name provider so you can buy domain names from them and it also acts as a hosting platform for hosting platform for any domains that you purchase either from within Shopify or from outside Shopify. Every domain name that is hosted in Shopify's platform is equipped with SSL. SSL stands for Secure Sockets Layer. Now you might have noticed in the URL above in trusted websites you're going to see HTTPS. Now that S signifies that that website has an SSL. It's a trusted website, it's secured, it's encrypted. So if you want to buy anything, if anyone wants to buy anything online, make sure that the URL contains HTTPS. But there are also other factors that go into determining uh, the security that you go through when purchasing something online. But that's one of the factors, one of the most fundamental factors for determining if you should trust that website to go to actually go through the checkout process and then to end your credit card info, your debit card info. So far, Shopify sounds great, right? But here's my most favorite feature about Shopify. It's the Shopify live chat. The support team in Shopify is actually one of the greatest, one of the best ones I've come across so far in my years of experience in business. You can chat with a real life person when you go to Shopify, the Shopify live chat at help.shopify.com forward slash questions. So I'm going to say that again help.shopify.com forward slash questions just address a question that you have any issues that you have with the platform any quest any un unanswered questions and a real life person will get back to you now here's a helpful tip for you guys if you're new to the shopify platform if you're interested in e-commerce you want to use shopify to host your online store on you want to learn more about the platform you have any unanswered questions or you just 
you're just uh, feeling lazy or it takes too much time to read these long blog posts, articles online, you don't have time to do that, then just go to the Shopify live chat and speak with a li real life person. I guarantee that they will address all of your questions. And even if they couldn't answer those questions at that time, they will follow up with you in email. So every conversation you have is recorded and it will be sent to your email once the conversation is over. Just ask anything you want, any time of the day, any time of the week, any time of the year. They don't have regular office hours like offline retail businesses. This service is open 24 hours a day, seven days in a week, 365, one over four days per year. So what I'm trying to say, it's, it's open pretty much any time of the day, any time you want. Down in the description below, I have a free link to the free 14-day Shopify trial. You can use it. That's all I have for you today. Those were my opinions on why I think that Shopify is the best e-commerce platform to host your online store on. If you found the content helpful, consider subscribing and hit the bell icon that comes with it so that you'll be notified of future video releases. I'll be talking more about entrepreneurship, online businesses, dropshipping, Shopify. Drop a like, leave a comment down in the comment section down below if there's anything that you'd like to say, any questions that you have, any videos that you'd like me to make. Remember to grab your free Shopify dropshipping hack book. It's down in the description below. It's a beginner-friendly step-by-step -step guide on Shopify dropshipping. Also in the description, I have a free 14-day Shopify trial link. You can try the platform out, see if it works best for you, your business. If it doesn't, then just cancel it. Plus, use the secret that I gave you just now, where you ask for an extension of the free trial if you think that the 14-day trial is not enough. I hope that this video has brought you value, has helped you go further in your business. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.